What's up guys, this is Dylan and Nicole here. We wanted to make a video. If you're a homeowner, we wanna give you the ability and the power to be able to value your own home. I know most people just look at Zillow and their Zestimates to see what they say your house is worth, but even if you go to Zillow, go to zillow.com, click Zestimates at the bottom, find the green bar, and then find your county. In fact, in Solano County, they even tell us they're about 20% off. So we wanna give you the ability to be able to know the true value of your own home's worth. Nicole, go ahead and tell them. All right, so we're gonna go through three things that you can do to value your own home. So the first one is going to be looking at the amenities of your particular home. So right now, Dylan, what do you think is more valuable to home buyers in this market? Stainless steel appliances or black appliances? Stainless steel appliances. Absolutely, we're seeing a huge demand for stainless steel right now. Same thing goes for what do you think is more valuable, hardwood floors or wall-to-wall -wall carpeting? Hardwood floors. Hardwood floors. And last question, what do you think is more valuable when it comes to countertops? What are your buyers looking for? Granite or quartz all day long. All day long. So if you have amenities like that that we mentioned and the home next door to you sold for a pretty decent price but had original was in original 80s condition, you can bet that your home is worth more. And the second thing that we can give you as a tip to help you value your own home is looking at the neighborhood. So one of the reasons that Zestimate, the Zestimate on Zillow is so off is because they put your house on a map and they draw a circle around it and they include values of homes that have sold in that circle. So I've yet to see a circular neighborhood, have you? Nope. Not a perfect circle. So what you really need to do is map out your neighborhood and understand the homes that are sold in your neighborhood yeah. specifically. Because the neighborhoods that the, the Zestimate and the Redfin Estimate are picking up may have a different school district, may have different tax brackets, That's true. may just have completely different amenities altogether. Yeah. So the third thing, this is probably the easiest thing that you can do. You can pick up the phone and call your local realtor and ask them to come by, give your home a free market evaluation and help you truly understand the value rather than just give you a number. And that's how you do it.